hello and welcome back to my channel my name is Ainora if you're new to my channel if you are my subscriber thank you so much for coming back and watching my videos today I would like to do a review of Louis Vuitton chain bag it's also called a passive bag um, and I'm going to review uh, this bag what fits in this bag what's inside my bag overall my review pros and cons and i'm also going to show the mod shots at the end of the video this bag is actually not mine i recently uh, did an unboxing and i mentioned that this bag i actually purchased for my mom so i will be talking uh, her as well her thoughts about this bag and also my thoughts about this bag i did take out this bag a couple times already and i did fill it fill all the things that i need for every day and even more i filled it out and i actually going i'm actually going to show what's inside but the dimensions of the bag is 24 centimeters uh, 17 centimeters in height and 12 centimeters in the width so I would say it's a really great everyday uh, bag uh, so let's go ahead and show you what's inside I filled it out so in the back pocket there's a really really great and generous bag pocket um, in this bag so as you see the, this one is an iPhone 11 Pro Max it's the biggest iPhone and it fits really really nicely uh, on the back pocket here we go you see so it I mean it, it doesn't really make the bag very bulky which is really good so there's a phone in the back um, which I'm gonna take it out for now so uh, the closure is just a magnetic and it's really really strong magnetic as you see it's pretty strong um, so the interior is a very nice uh, like a suede no it's actually it's a microfiber uh, inside it, it is like a really nice rich burgundy color I hope it's showing and inside I already put all my things inside I actually have a lot than I expected so in the there's a front pocket where I added my where I put my YSL card holder so I carry most of my award or discount or like everything like the card like for stores I keep it here like IKEA and all the kinds of cards so let's go to the main part as you see it's all filled the first thing I have a four key holder uh, from Louis Vuitton it's, the, it's really nice and slim I have the six key holder as well but I actually really like for smaller bags a four key holder I have my airpods this is a really cute a case for the airpods I have my main wallet from Louis Vuitton as well. I have also, I've, I've always showed this in my videos. I really like this. It's really, really nice. I have a hand sanitizer. I actually have a 30 milliliter um, YSL perfume. This, this whole thing fits in this little bag which I am very surprised because not many small bags fit a perfume and the last thing I have here is my mini pochette uh, accessories I think and inside I have a whole bunch of things for everything in my life so I have like a mascara I have a bandage <laughs> and I have a hand lotion and a little perfume and I have a lipstick, a pen and tampons, I mean whatever you need uh, it's all inside uh, in this mini pochette and this, this little thing is so nice, I love it, uh, it pretty much holds all of my little things and little essentials so this really organizes my bag 
and in the so there's in the back there's another zipper uh, pocket which is really convenient um, if you have like a key probably I mean all the all the little things that you might be scared to lose so this a little like a this back pocket is really generous and it's really thoughtful that they added this and in the back of the zipper pocket so there's another like another pocket actually and I have IB it's an it's an ibuprofen um, I have it just in case if I'm if I have like a headache or something so this bag is actually really really thoughtful bag I mean it they really thought about this bag adding all the necessary pockets for everything so I really love the how they added the back pocket there's a zipper pocket there's the main pocket like the main compartment which is very wide and deep and then there's a, a, like an outside pocket which are really great for little things like a card holder yeah so and it fits a lot of things in the back as well the back pocket is pretty generous as you see I just went ahead and put everything uh, into the back again just to show you how it fits how it looks and and the lock is very strong and my cell phone is in the back as you see so uh, regarding the chain uh, strap so because it has both chain and uh, leather strap it's actually really convenient to use um, as a shoulder bag but then if you want to use this bag as a crossbody you can basically take out um, you can basically make the chain longer and actually carry it the leather part on your shoulders and the leather part is actually a lot it's not like it's not like just a tiny bit leather so you have a lot of like a lot of space of leather uh, strap so when it goes to your shoulders when it goes as a crossbody you definitely have a lot of leather so the chain doesn't rub your shoulder which mainly a lot of uh, bags do dig in because they don't have enough of the leather part here so I, I'm mainly really, really satisfied and really happy with this bag. That I, it's not my bag, again, I'm saying because it's, this is my mom's bag. But if I was looking for a bag from Louis Vuitton right now, I would go for this instead of going to like, instead of getting like my pochette metis or a speedy or anything that's just pretty much very saturated right now so a lot of people have those bags and if you're looking for something new and something practical but yet classy but modern and like everyday or evening bag this bag actually f hits all of those points and I think this bag really really uh, needs to talk more about because it does have all of the functions that has pochette metis or I don't know like any other bags I can't think of any other bags but all I can think is pochette metis and then I think there's another bag like Dauphine uh, Dauphine is not really saturated but still if you are not into Dauphine then this bag would be really nice to consider. I think there's another another style of this passy bag. Um, I, I think I've seen it in a leather, but I think this bag in the monogram with the understated LV uh, logo looks really, really nice and classy, yet it's a very, very modern and new bag. So I totally suggest this bag to anyone who's looking into getting another Louis Vuitton bag 
or this would be a really nice as a first Louis Vuitton purchase so because it's a really really like um, classy Louis Vuitton monogram and yet it has all the elements like the chain the leather it has all of the pockets and functionality but yet it looks like an evening bag as well you can be you can use it day and night so let me go ahead and show you how it looks on my body this is how it looks on my shoulder I like the length um, how it sits on my shoulders I am 5'7 for a reference And I'll show you how it looks as a crossbody. And this is how it looks as a crossbody on me. The length is really, really good on me. The main part, the main con on this back is the chain is not adjustable. Like on Pachette Mitis, the, the strap was adjustable and it's suitable for any height. But this bag has not adjustable strap so you have to pretty much think about if you are really tall this might sit a little higher if you are short on shorter side this might be a lot longer than on me but i am 5'7 so and this bag perfectly works on me and my mom is like 5'6 five, 5'5 five, five, and on her body this bag is actually really great so I would totally recommend this bag. This is a, such a great classic, uh, yet modern and yet a new bag from Louis Vuitton. And I'm so happy that my mom owns it. Would I get it for myself? If I didn't have already logo uh, bags, monogram bags, this might be a perfect option for me. I sold my pochette mitis because I was really sick of it and because there, it had a lot of vachetta on it and uh, I, I just sold it because a lot of people had it pretty much and I was just sick of, sick of it. But if I'll go for another monogram Louis Vuitton bag, this would be my choice. So thank you so much for watching. Hopefully this video was useful. Please subscribe to my channel, like my videos, and follow me on Instagram. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.